Mama Simantare, the self-styled Ankola King, has adopted a king's lifestyle, complete with royal regalia following a disputed enthronement last year. The climate to the Ankola throne has a humble palace located at Itaba Culture Site in Rampara County in Barara District. However, the government has come out to disown a Simwe following what Minister of Gender and Social Development, Janat Mukwaya, says was an illegal enthronement. The minister does not have any communication in writing whatsoever to indicate that the supporters of Mr. Simwe Umar have duly followed the process provided for under the law. Therefore, Mr. Umaru's enthronement as the king of the people of Ankole is contrary to the provisions of the institution of the Traditional Cultural Leaders Act. In a meeting the minister held with Asimwe together with his purported royal cabinet ministers, Janat Mukwaya urged the self-styled king to stop calling himself a king or else the government would arrest him and prosecute him in courts of law. Consequently, the minister hereby directs Mr. Asimwe Umar and his supporters to stop forthwith his activities on matters related to the creation of a traditional cultural institution in Ankole. Mukwaya said that the secret enthronement of Asimwe Rwamba Sintare VI was illegal because it contravenes the provisions in the Institution of Cultural Leaders Act of 2011. If they want to, to be healers like other um, Bachwes, let them go and register under the Ministry of Internal Affairs as an NGO traditional healers. If they have that certificate of traditional healers, police and other agencies will not attack them. But should they continue to have people around them without registering as healers, then the police will go after them. When NTV contacted Umar Asimwe in his Rampara home for a comment, he said the constitution gives people power to decide on anything they want, adding that they are suspicious of the provisions of the Cultural Leaders Act. Constitution yeye angati le rubata rubamnong. Michoro kule bana hinda hinu kabrakanya. Haka wiro no kwa zvaji hindu ire. Echirioni bate zomtoe. Eri teka tu kuzaguli yesa gamnonga. Abo kuba nimpami yangu riyo ndijerangu. Omuntu sheme kuba na abo mugabe. Kuri jira umbazar uangoku na zirwe. Nana emijenzo iba kwa ba kuzire. Tere kwa government. He has also vowed to proceed with his cultural activities, claiming that he's a king by descent and that government should give him the necessary support instead of threatening him with arrest. On the other side of the kingship dispute in Ankore is Charles Rebshenje, son to late Omugabe of Ankore, John Baraji, who passed away in 2011. Whereas Ankore Kingdom remains unrecognized since the 1967 aborted directive, the two factions claim the rightful heirship to the throne. Shiran Rochere, NTV.